Electric. It's choreographed by Debbie Rushton and Roman Brashmi. It is a 96 count, two wall, phrased, easy intermediate level line dance with no tags and no restarts. The phrasing for the dance is A, B, C, A, B, C, B, C, C to end the dance. All parts of this dance are 32 counts. I'm gonna turn around and break down the dance part by part, section by section, facing the front wall, all the way through with steps and counts. We'll then practice each part with steps and counts before going around and doing the full dance so that you know where everything happens and you can hopefully dance this on a dance floor near you. So let's turn around and learn electric. We're gonna start with part A. Weights on that left foot, we're gonna do two walks forward, so we're gonna step forward, right, step forward, left. We're now gonna bend both knees down and you're gonna sit over your right foot and we're gonna straighten our knees up, coming back over our left. You're gonna take your right toe, touch it next to your left, but slightly out to the side, so you want a little bit of an area to allow for a twist. We're now gonna make a quarter turn over our right shoulder, keeping our weight on our left foot, turning to the right, to phase three o'clock, and then we're going to sit back down, bending both knees down over our left, and we're gonna come back up, straightening our knees, keeping our weight on our left foot. So let's try that with some counts. We're doing that walk forward. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Section two, we're gonna do two kickball steps. So we're gonna kick our right foot low and forward, step our right next to our left, and do a small step forward with your left. We're now going to repeat that, so kick your right foot forward, step it next to your left, a small step forward with your left. We're going to step forward with our right, and we're going to make a half turn over our left shoulder, putting our weight onto our left foot to face 9 o'clock. We're now going to do a full turn, so we're going to start by making a half turn over our left shoulder, stepping back with our right foot. You're going to make another half turn over your left shoulder, stepping forward with your left. You'll return to 9 o'clock. So let's try that part with some counts. We just sit and straighten. We're doing our kick step step. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. Section three. We're gonna take our right foot, we're gonna step it forward, and as you step forward, you're gonna roll your hip forward to the right, and then you're gonna come back and settle it back down over your left foot. So you want that to make kind of like a curve, so it's like your foot is coming up, and then down coming back onto your left foot, still facing nine o'clock. We're now going to do a weave that's gonna make a quarter turn. So we're gonna make that quarter turn over our left shoulder, stepping back with our right. You're now at six o'clock. You're gonna step your left foot to the side and cross your right over your left. We're now going to do a body roll to the left as we step our left foot to the left side. So as you step to the left, you're gonna start your body roll with your shoulder head area roll it and then come down step your right next to your left we're going to do that roll again stepping our left foot to the side you're going to roll to the left touch your right foot next to your left so let's try that with some counts weights on the left foot we're facing nine o'clock we're going to do that step and roll one two three and four five six seven eight section four in our final section of a we're going to do a rolling vine. So we're gonna make a quarter turn over our right shoulder, stepping forward with our right. You're now at nine o'clock. We're going to make a half turn over our right shoulder, stepping back with your left to return to three o'clock. We're now going to make a quarter turn over our right shoulder, stepping our right foot to the side. You'll be at six, cross your left over your right. We're now going to do a modified V step. So we're gonna take our right toe, we're gonna to step it forward. So we're gonna rise up on the balls of each feet, stepping our right into the right diagonal. Step your left foot into the left diagonal onto the balls of both feet. We're now gonna step back with our right, settling down onto our right foot and cross our left over our right. And that is the end of A. So let's try that part with some counts. We ended touching our right next to our left. We're going to do that rolling vine. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is all of A. So when we dance A in both phrasing sections, so when we do the first set of ABC and the second set of ABC, the first set A will be danced to the front. The second time we do it, it will be danced to the back wall. So let's try A all the way through, one time with steps, one time with counts. Weights on your left foot, we're walking forward. Walk 
walk, bend, rise, touch, quarter turn, bend, rise, kick, fall, step, kick, fall, step, step, half, 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 push, recover, behind, quarter, side, roll, together, roll, touch, quarter, half, quarter, cross, up, up, down, cross. Let's try that with some counts. Weights on that left foot, we're walking. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And that is all of A. Next, we will dance B. B will technically happen the first time to the back wall, but I'm going to turn around to the front so that you can see what it looks like. So weights on your left foot, we would have crossed over to end A. B starts with your step to the right. So we're gonna do a big step to the right, drag your left toe into your right and rock your left foot behind your right, recover forward onto that right foot. We're now going to repeat that to the left, so a big step to the left, drag that right foot into your left, rock your right foot behind your left, recover forward onto your left foot. Let's try that with some counts, we're sliding. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Section two, we're gonna do a Monterey half turn. So we're gonna take our right toe, point it to the right side, and as you point to the right side, you wanna twist your body towards the left to give you some leverage for a half turn. So we're gonna make that half turn, keeping our weight on our left foot. We're going to turn a half turn over our right shoulder, and then we're gonna step our right foot next to our left to face six o'clock. Weight's now on your right foot. We're gonna point our left toe to the side, step our left next to our right. We're now gonna step our right foot to the side, and as we step our right foot to the side, you're gonna shimmy your shoulders. You're gonna go shimmy, shimmy, and we're gonna hitch our left knee up. We're now gonna repeat that to the left, so we're gonna step down with our left, and we're gonna shimmy our shoulders to the left. Shimmy, shimmy, weights on our left foot, hit your right knee up. So let's try that with some counts. Weights on your left foot, we're doing our Monterey. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Now those slides that we did to start B, we're going to repeat them. So we're gonna do our big step to the right, drag our left toe and arm to our right, rock back, our left behind our right, recover onto your right foot. Now do that big step to the left, drag your right foot into your left, rock your right foot behind your left, recover. Try that with some counts, big step to the right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Section four in our final section of B, we're going to do that Monterey half turn again. So we're gonna point our right toe to the right side, twisting our body to the left. You're gonna make that half turn on your left foot over your right shoulder, step your right foot next to your left to face 12 o'clock. Point your left toe to the left side, step your left foot next to your right. We're now going to do a full walk around, but it's in place and it's kind of quick. So we're gonna slightly bend our knees and we're gonna keep everything in place. So we're gonna make that quarter turn stepping onto our right, make a quarter turn stepping onto your left, make a quarter turn stepping onto your right, and make a quarter turn stepping onto your left, you'll return to 12 o'clock. So we're turning over our left shoulder. You're going right to nine o'clock-ish, left to six o'clock-ish, right to three o'clock, and left back to 12 o'clock, or whatever wall we had started on. So let's try that with some counts. We're doing that Monterey turn. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And you wanna start low and kind of come back up as you end at the wall that we started at. So let's try that part all the way through, one time with steps, one time with counts. So our weight is on our left foot, slightly crossed over our right. We're going to do our slide to the right. So it's slide, rock back, recover, slide, rock back, recover, Monterey, half, and your step, shimmy, hitch, Step, shimmy, hitch, slide, rock back, recover, slide, rock back, recover, Monterey, half, and your walk, right, left, right, left, to come back to 12 o'clock. Let's try it with some counts. 
Weights on, left cross over right. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 And that is all of B. The first time we do B, it will be to the back wall or the six o'clock wall. All the rest of the times that we do B, you will do it facing 12 o'clock. Now let's talk about C. C is our electric slide style section. So we're gonna start C by doing a grapevine to the right and the left. So we're gonna step right foot side, left behind, right side, touch left. Same thing to the left, left side, right behind, left side, touch right. Let's try it with some counts, stepping that right foot to the side. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Section two, we're gonna do three walks back, right, left, right, and you're gonna to touch your left toe next to your right. We're now gonna step forward with our left and touch our right next to our left. Step back with your right, touch your left next to your right. So let's try that part with some counts. We're walking back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Section three, we're going to make a quarter turn over our left shoulder. We're gonna hop a quarter turn. So this right foot's gonna come staying in place and your left foot's gonna really make that turn. So we're gonna go out. And now you're going to pose and hold for three counts. However you wanna pose, it's up to you, head, hips, whatever. Whatever you would like to do for those three counts. And then we're going to sway our hips to the right, to the left, to the right, to the left. Let's try that part with some counts. So we would have just done our walk back, touch, step, touch, back, touch. We're gonna hop to the left, turning over that left shoulder. So it's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. And like I said, do that pose however you would like, hands on your hips, up on your head, whatever feels good for you is the pose that you can do. Our final section of C, we're going to do a rocking chair. So we're gonna step our right foot forward, recover back onto your left, step your left right foot back, recover onto your left foot. We're now going to do a three quarter paddle around. So we're gonna turn over our left shoulder. We're gonna make a quarter turn, touching our right toe to the right side. You're now at six. You're gonna make another quarter turn over your left shoulder, touching your right toe to the side. You're at three. We're gonna make another quarter turn over our left shoulder, touching our right toe to the side. You're at 12. And then you're going to touch your right next to your left. And that is the end of C. So let's try that last part with some counts. We're rocking forward and back. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. End of C. So now let's do C all the way through, one time with steps, one time with counts, and then we'll walk through the whole phrasing. Vine to the right, side behind, side touch, side behind, side touch, three walks back, right, left, right, touch, step, touch, back, touch, quarter turn, out, hold, 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 sway, 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 right rocking chair. And now your three quarter paddle, touch, 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 touch. And then you're ready to either do A or B or C again, depending on where we are in this dance. So now let's dance the first section of phrasing through, A, B, C. The first time we do it, A is going to be to the front wall and B and C will be to the back. The next time we do it, A will be to the back wall and B and C will be to the front. So we're starting with, with our A, which is our walk, walk part. So A, it's walk, walk, bend, rise, point, quarter, turn, bend, rise, kick, ball, step, kick, ball, step, step, half, 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 push, recover, quarter, side, cross, roll together, roll, touch. Rolling vine with a cross. Now your toe lifts out, out, in, cross. Now we're going to do B that slide. Slide, rock back, recover, slide, rock back, recover, Monterey, 
half with your shimmy hitch, shimmy hitch, slide, rock back, recover, slide, rock back, recover, Monterey half with your full run around over your left shoulder, right, left, right, left. Now we're going to do C grapevine, side behind, side touch, side behind, side touch, walk it back, right, left, right, touch, step, touch, back, touch, hop a quarter, and out, hold, 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 right, left, right, left, right, rocking chair, in your three quarter paddle, right, 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 touch. Now we're going to do A to the back wall. It's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One and two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three and four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Do B. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Slide one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. C. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. 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 From here, we are going to do a B and then two C's to end the dance. So we're gonna do our slide, slide, rock back, recover, slide, rock back, recover, Monterey half with your step shimmy hitch, hitch, step shimmy hitch. Now slide, rock back, recover, slide, rock back, recover, Monterey half. And now your run to the left, right, left, right, left, two C's, grapevine, side, behind, side touch. Side behind, side touch, walk it back. And step, touch, back, touch. And hop a quarter, out. Hold, hold, sway, 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 rocking chair. And your three quarter paddle, 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 paddle. Do it again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then it ends on that eight count. So sometimes, however you would like to end it, if you just want to touch next to you, you can in their videos or how Debbie and Dance It, they do some sort of big ending or they point to each other. So however you would like to end on that eight count is kind of up to you. So I hope this helped you learn electric. If you have any questions, let me know. Thanks guys.